design a dog. Never fear, pets of Bartsville. Our far fit away. Commercial messages. Ooh, it's my favorite commercial. First pick out and fluff your pup. Would you like to build your own stuffed animal, dress it up, and take it home to play? I would love that. <laughs> well, you two look like you're having a good time. <gasps> oh, I had tons of fun with the toys in this box, but it's time someone else got to have fun with them. Ribbit. Look, Look what, what you, you get. did! Look, Look what, what you, you did! Oh, did you guys just ruin Ruff Ruff? Ruin who's what? Bob in his room with Ruff Ruff, Bob at the beach with Ruff Ruff, Bob at the... Just about everywhere he went with Ruff Ruff. Aww. Let's go! Design a dog today. Yay! Let's go! <laughs> First pick out and fluff your pup. Then you sew your puppy up. This Ruin place is amazing! And come out there! One perfectly poofy pooch. Come on, Rolly. Let's take Ruff Ruff in there and make him perfectly poofy too. Ruff Ruff needs just enough stuff to stuff him up so he's stuffed. That's a lot of stuff for Ruff Ruff. Whoa! That's way too stuffed! Now it's time to sew this puppy up. But we're gonna need some kid power to do it. Chloe? Wow, that looks so good! <laughs> and there's just one more thing to do with this doggy, so follow me. When I go down, you go up. And when you go up, I'll go down. We're doing. I think we use too much bingo and rolly power. Sometimes bingo and rolly power can be a dangerous thing. And now it's time to get our doggy looking dog tacular. First, we get him clean, then, we give him some style. And we might as well get ourselves looking good, too. Here comes the cleaning. I like that color. It matches my eyes. We did it, Rolly. Bob's toy looks as good as it ever did. Okay, it's time for the tea pup party. Everybody choose a stuffed doggy. Oh. Rolly, they think we're toys. Yeah, but they dressed us up so nice for their party, we should stick around, just to be polite. Pretend food? Let me tell you something. That's no party. And pretend tea? Drink your tea, fancy doggy. Go, go, go. Looks like the party's over. Yep. Oh no! What if she takes Bob's toy? What if we take it first? Faster, Rolly, faster! Oh no, I'm rolling too fast! Okay, everybody, have a good day! Bye-bye! <laughs> <sighs> yep, Bob won't even know we took it out of the box. <laughs> hey, guys! <laughs> Give me a minute before I say hello, okay? I just need to put this stuff outside. You're just giving this stuff away? To anybody who wants it. <gasps> I want it. Can I keep them, Mommy? Please? I'm glad I found someone to give Ruff Ruff to. Because I don't need a pretend doggy anymore. I have two of the best... Ice, Ice Puggy. I finished mowing the backyard for you to play in. Now I just want to pour myself a big glass of iced tea before I leave. Oh no! Iced tea! Oh, 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 oh. I can't stop thinking about delicious iced tea! Cool. It's more than cool, it's cold. Doesn't matter where it is. 
supposed to get to that Antarctica place Arf showed us on the wall? I don't know. Hey, we got a window seat! Which of this ice do you think would be best for Bob's iced tea? I don't know. Maybe we should ask those penguins that are sliding right toward us. Sliding right toward who? Oh, well, you're talking to the right penguin. I can go find you the best ice there is. You do that for us? You've been walking around with that thing under there? How do you do that with that slipping and sliding all over the ice? Just sniffly. The weather is wintry. But if, if, if you waddle, 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 we get storms here that blow everything around and turn everything wild. I don't know. It could be forever. Or not forever at all. Where did Mr. Penguin go? Well, <laughs> I wish we were warm and toasty. Well, then, let's see what else is in this box. Yes, yeah, so we can't let it get away. It's going into that cave. And so are we. Yeah. Whoa, 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 whoa. Because it wasn't. Something under that hat. <laughs> yeah, and we can see if he found Bob's ice. But wait, what if he follows our tracks and comes into this cave thinking we're here? So it's a good thing Bob put this ice drawing thing in my collar in case I ever needed to draw something on ice. <laughs> I think I smiley face too hard. We're not trapped in here. Okay, go that way. But that way doesn't go the right way. We found the way out. Uh. How are we going to get to her? This ice is all slippy and slidey. We should waddle. That's what Mr. Penguin said penguins do so they don't fall down. Nothing on me has ever gone to crack like that. It wasn't you. It was the ice cracking. <laughs> we made it. Yeah! Oh no! Mr. Penguin! I found the ice you were looking for. Do you have my egg? We have something even better. Oh, you boys did a great job watching my egg and taking care of my little girl while I went out looking for your eyes. Thanks! <laughs> Go ahead. Take all you want. But I don't think that'll fit in Bob's glass for his iced tea. We'd love to stay here and play with you, but my brother and I have to get home as fast as we can. How are things on the bottom of the earth? Cold, icy. Helps if you waddle. Huh. Did you get the ice Bob needs for his iced tea? We sure did. The best there is. Here. Oh. Good idea, hissy. Fill her up. Oh, this is gonna taste so good. Does this mean we finished our mission? Yep. Hi. <laughs> 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 How was your flight? A little bumpy on the landing. How I wish I could be with you. So, I invented this to do the kinds of things I'd do if I was here. Hi, Bingo. Hi, Rolly. I call him ARF, which stands for Auto Doggy Robotic Friend. ARF is here to do it all. I even programmed him to clean up any mess that you make before I get home from work. <laughs> But with Arp here, no more mess. Hmm, he looks friendly. Wanna meet Arf? Maybe later. I'm trying to get this one spot on the back of my neck really clean, which means... Make a mess, yeah, make a mess, so Arf can have fun cleaning it up. Wait a minute, you want us to mess this place up? So 
one day. But first, I gotta learn how to read. Oh, nice job. I can hardly see the floor at all. I'm okay. Wow, if Bob came home from work and saw a mess like this... Bob also programmed Arf to beg. I don't think we have another mess in us. Yeah. I either need a longer leg or a shorter neck. Leave me alone, dog body. Wait! No! Wait! Excuse, Arv. Oh, Arv is excused. Because Bob only programmed Arv to clean up after Bingo and Rolly, not to clean up after Hissy and Arv. So I guess the two of us are gonna have to clean this place ourselves. Puppy dog style. That sounds kind of fun. It's not gonna be fun, Rolly. It's going to be work. Clean up time, working together. Let's get that man to the floor. Just gotta wash these towels, and our job is done. What are we gonna do while they're washing? I'm gonna get you, Turkey! Hey, Rolly! Whoa! Whoa! Quick question! How much soap did you put in that washing machine? Look at me, Bingo! Ho, ho, ho! Clothes right after they come out of the washing machine. Ha. I guess my new invention really worked, huh? Oh. Excuse I The Go Long Retriever. <laughs> Let it go, Rolly. Well, it looks like you two are in the mood for a fetch-filled day. But I've got something better than a drippy old stick. I invented it just for you. I've already started over on several versions of this invention because they weren't working right. I hope this is the one that finally works. Play fetch with me. <laughs> oh, somebody needs to bring it back. I got it! I was here first! Good job! <laughs> Yippity dog! I think this one's a keeper! When that stick lands somewhere but you can't get it, there it goes again! Now watch it come right back! See you later, doggy dudes! Too bad about that stick. It seemed really nice for a stick. I wonder why it didn't come back. No, no, no. Broly, Bob said he needed to start over with a new version of his invention. So maybe we should help him by getting rid of this one for him. Play fetch with me. <laughs> no, you silly stick. <laughs> We're trying to get rid of you. <laughs> Blast off! Bob says we're always leaving our toys here, so this is the perfect place to get rid of the stick. <laughs> the perfect place to get rid of what? Leave us alone, Cupcake. Oh, 
Oh, this is a weird game that Stick likes to play. It keeps wanting to come back to us because that's what Bob made it to do. Well, then I changed my mind. I don't want it. Rufus, let go of that stick! Dig a big hole and drop it in. Then kick that dirt back on top again. Bury it. A puppy's gonna bury it. See you later, Stick. I mean, we don't want to see you later, Stick. Yeah, you're being grounded. <laughs> you're a good hole digger, Rolly. And you just... Uh, it just keeps wanting to play with us some more. Play fetch with me. Okay, if that stick is going to keep coming at us... Play fetch with me. Play fetch with me. Come on. That stick won't be able to find us if we hide in there. Play fetch with me. Won't that stick just go boingity boing 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 in here and then we'll have to run away again? Woohoo! Yeah! What's that sound? The bouncy house is losing its air! Yeah, that sign said so! Play fetch with me! Play fetch with me! Can't you just please stop trying to come back to us? Yeah, we want to get out of this sticky situation. Not yet. Not yet. Now! Now for real now? Now for real now! Play fetch with me. Me neither, but at least we did what Bob wanted us to do. Yeah, when we want to get rid of something, we get it gotten rid of. Huh? huh? Play fetch with me. This way! Run! Listen. Are you two having a doggy house day? It's Bob! Oh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> hey! <laughs> Bob, you're, you're you. you! Whoa! <laughs> Not tired of fetch yet, huh? How about we... Play fetch with me! Uh, no thanks. Play fetch with me! Uh, don't really want to. Play fetch with me! <laughs> 